couple different ways to pasteurize the media. One of them is hot water. That'll be the first one we discuss. There's a slide on that. The other couple are going to be uh, peroxide treatments. You might have heard of those. And that would be diluting 3% 10 to 1, so you're down to 3 tenths of a percent, right? And then you've got, you soak that overnight. It's a cool pasteurization. You drain it and you spawn it immediately. All right? Mushroom mycelium is very resistant to peroxide, so it's uh, it would hiss off, and then the mycelium would just take over that media. It's probably the most expensive way to do it, actually. Um, the other method is a lime bath method. Lime, which would be hydrated lime, not agricultural lime. Hydrated lime, which is super high calcium and very, very low magnesium. So when you're buying lime, it has to be before below 4% magnesium. I found it as low as two and even one. I would, the lowest magnesium content you can get. All you do that is the same same thing. You soak your straw, you soak your, your media, your substrate in that lime bath. You get your lime bath down to a pH of nine. And then you submerge your straw into it. So you can use little test strips and whatnot. Uh, I've got these. I still have them in my bag. These little litmus type papers. All right, this one I, I use for, this one's not good enough. This one's uh, has a narrow, more of a narrow pH band for, for uh, if we were using it in the lab for testing certain things, for testing soil samples. It's not analytical grade, obviously, but it, it does the trick. You can buy them with a pH of zero to 14, and then you would just dip it in there, and what you're looking for is nine. All right. You can also get them that are more sensitive at a higher pH. So you can get them that are sensitive to 7 to 14. This is 5 and a half to 8. This one's good for constructing like uh, uh, substrates. But this one obviously will not go up to 9. If it's pitch black, obviously it's probably going to be somewhere around 9. But typically I would put about a cup in... Uh, in a five gallon drum like that, it would do the trick. It's very strong, all right? So check the pH, then you're gonna dunk it. That's the second method. Third, hot, a third, and then fourth is hot water, excuse me, um, solar pasteurization. That's fourth. Um, and that means you could uh, wrap the, um, wrap the substrate. You're gonna have to pre-soak it. Right, pre-soak your uh, straw in water or pre-treat 